All right, good morning. I'm here with uh, the Sean Hale from Fritz Aquatics at the Shedd Aquarium because today is my 21st birthday. And so uh, we have actually an interview with WBBM. It's a very popular radio station here in Chicago. We're gonna be telling him all about the Aquashella Aquarium Festival that we're putting on here. And then I have a friend who's gonna let us into the Shedd Aquarium and give us a tour, so. Playbo. The story's running on the radio throughout the day and then it'll be on the website. This is M. Oh, my name is Emiliano. I volunteered here at Shed. He's going to be giving us a little bit of a tour. All right, this is the Amazon room. We actually have our own Amazon room at Aquashella. Some weird creatures here. Now they always say congratulations. Work so hard for the house on vacation. Medusa right there. That's, that's Zeus. The new exhibit Shed Aquarium has, it replaced uh, amphibians. Uh, and you know, it basically compiles a bunch of underwater beautiful stuff. We're gonna see some ribbon eels, some seahorses like Pegasus. Ooh. Uh, I don't wanna spoil you anything. Okay, yet. okay. behind Aquashella is that everybody gets some orange glasses that have a filter on it that turns your coral from this to this. Perry the platypus. We are always entering a new environment. We don't ever know fully what the new environment is because the only environments we know are the past ones. There is always then operating in uh, the development of cellular life on any level higher than any existing form, and we are not aware of it until after it's happened. the Caribbean Reef, real big exhibit, 90,000 gallons, right? A lot of room for a lot of fish. Home to green sea turtle nickel, been a rescue since 2003. In there, they send volunteer divers like me to feed the tarpon, feed the stingrays, to feed everything in there. It's been here since around the 70s, but the aquarium itself has been here since 1930. So we made a quick stop at Leonis, which is my favorite deep dish pizza chain here in Chicago. And uh, we picked up some pizza and salad for the guys working at the convention center. 
They'll be serving this pizza at the show, both deep dish and the thin. So even if you don't like deep dish pizza, which in that case, we can't be friends, you'll at least be able to enjoy uh, their thin crust pizza. All right, we're at the White Eagle Convention Center. So this is the entrance. This is the main convention area. Uh, it's day one of setup, so the whole thing is empty right now, but this whole convention center will get transformed. Uh, I don't wanna give away too much of what we're doing because it really will blow your mind when you see it in person for the first time. So it's not really fair for me to spoil the surprise. We do have one panel of Raphael's artwork out right now, so I'll give you a little sneak peek. Check it out. Okay, that's it. I can't show you guys too much, but there will be dozens and dozens of panels just like that painted in fluorescent paint by this man, RC yes. Studios. Yes, we're excited. We're I working. painted one of them too. You didn't I'll paint. I'll tell you at the show. You didn't paint anything. <laughs> <laughs> no. Why you always lying? Hey George, how you doing? Uh, I've been catching you on YouTube and all the channels for Aquashella, man. I'm a big fan. No way. How big is your tank? What kind of tank do you have? I just got a 100 gallon. It's a reefer 350. That's nuts. <laughs> yeah. I'm looking to add a couple pieces to it here. Gonna meet that guy, uh, Brandon, from uh, Frag House Corals. Yes. Yeah, he's I heard he's got some hot stuff there, so. All right, dude. Thank you so much. Appreciate right. it. Hey, George, man. Yeah, it was nice to meet you. That is like the funniest it's coincidence ever. Hey. All right, let's go outside to check on some of our other artists. Um, oh, man. This is Tony Martin, one of our 10 artists. They're great. Justin, what's your favorite color? Ah, uh, the bright one. All right, Tony. You might not recognize this guy anymore without his uh without his Ooh. beard. Oh man, it's all gone. <laughs> I saw a couple hundred fish stores with this dude in a truck just like that one. Don't remind me. Yeah, I know. Bad memories. <laughs> Okay, I gotta leave them alone now so they can get back to work. Um, I'm super lucky though to be working with such an awesome creative team on Aquashella Chicago. I'm really hoping to see you guys at the event. Make sure to go get your tickets at aquashella.com so you can join us. Also, I didn't mention this before, but these are the official Aquashella t-shirts. The t-shirts are made in fluorescent ink, so they also glow in the UV light. Be sure to pick one of these up at the show. We'll be selling these on our website at, after the festival ends as well. So if you can't make it to Aquashella, you'll still be able to get one online. This is the Planet Aquarium's restaurant. Sean, tell them about the VIP after party that's gonna be held here on Saturday night. Come with me. This is Planet Aquarium's restaurant. You're gonna be able to have corn dogs here, hot dogs, Italian beef sandwiches, Maxwell Street Polish sausage, thin and deep dish crust pizza, as well as a kid's menu and a garden salad. But I'm not done yet. All right, so within the restaurant, there is a full-size bar. Which is really good because it's actually George's 21st birthday. He's been coming to shows with me for over four years, so this was really special, and we've made a special drink for him. We're gonna try it now. So at Aquashella, we have a custom drink menu and this right here is called the Aquashella. Be sure when you're at Aquashella to come here to the bar and get one of the Shellas. Yeah, George. What do you think, George? Yeah, baby. <laughs> now that I've fully lost my innocence on this YouTube channel, Band. we return to our normal uh, broadcasting. This will probably be the last video I make before the festival, so if you haven't already, make sure to go get your tickets at Aquashella.com. Until then, Remember to keep those nitrates low. George, ow. Hi guys, my name is George, and I just wanted to let you guys know I'm gonna set up an aquarium today. Tasty too. <laughs> What's your name? Hi, Justin, incredible. I'm Mikey, nice to meet <laughs> nice you. Nice to meet you. So much, just like. The name's Justin. Who are you? I'm incredible. Incredible. <laughs> Gosh, I'm fascinating her. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Why?
know what? I'll be out at 6 a.m. painting wood tomorrow. It's good to be the boss. That's okay. No one will send out the emails. No one will make all the digital PDFs. No one will do all that yeah, stuff. And the whole show will fail. That's on you. <laughs> Here you go, Uncle Dan. Uncle Dan. Cheers. That reminds me of Walter White. Are we getting food or what? What are we doing? Oh, <laughs> so good. Just like moms. <laughs> hey, this is Aquashella helper, Uncle Dan. That's my third trip to Home Depot today. I don't have a saltwater aquarium because my landlord uh -huh. doesn't let, let us have pets. Uh. I've asked him before, he's like, hey, can I have a pet? And no. <laughs> but we're planning on leaving soon, uh -huh. and I already got my 55-gallon tank, so as soon as I leave, yeah. we're, getting a, we're getting a saltwater. Right now.